Sandile Masondo believes indigenous languages are sidelined in South Africa. Now he's taking some big steps, literally across KwaZulu Natal, to get people discussing their value. It all started when he failed a university entrance examination a few years ago. I went far as going to the university where they rejected me because simply because I couldn't understand English. And I think there's more that should be done in terms of judging people with their language. Rather, we, let us judge them with what they can come up with. Along his 3,000 kilometer route, Masondo is hoping to find out how language barriers have affected locals and the opportunities they may have missed due to an inability to converse in English. He wants to hand over the results of this survey to the Arts and Culture Department for consideration. And an African languages expert says there is merit in Masondo's concerns. When a person comes to an environment that is based on English concept, it becomes hard to interpret or to understand what is it that they exactly mean with a particular concept. There are studies that have been done that mother tongue uh, teaching, it's always a success. Masondo expects to complete his journey in August. Desen Tathia, Mpangeni, Natal. News that moves. ENCA.com.